What's happening, I think, is a transformation of the field of management. Sustainability principles are now part of the core business decision making of any organization. And so today's manager now has to understand the physical dimensions of sustainability. I think that ultimately the future of the field of management is going to look a lot like this program. Right now, we're one of the very few places doing this. I came to the sustainability management program looking for a career change. What really attracted me about the SUMA program was the opportunity to learn more about sustainability and climate science, but also enhance my finance and business skills. The sustainability management program gave me an opportunity to uh, pinpoint those skill sets I wanted to gain and to take classes appropriately for those. The fact that many of the courses were at night or in the afternoon freed up the day for other opportunities. Most of the people that come into this program have a pretty clear picture of what they want to learn, and so we provide them with many, many options. There's the courses we offer directly, but then we also offer them access to other courses in other schools throughout the university. The best thing by far about this program is the teamwork the colleagues that you get to work with and the various industries that they're from. The diverse student body brings all of the pieces that are necessary for different projects that you're going to come across in the real world. What makes this program different from other programs in sustainability is the backing of the Earth Institute. You have an access that's unprecedented to the leaders there and the scientists there that help you really understand the main elements of sustainability. Faculty are top-notch practitioners in their fields, bringing us the real-time experience that they are having. They bring examples into the classroom of, of their work. They invite their colleagues to come in and talk about the work they're doing. We met a lot of bright people from a number of schools, but Henry stuck out. There was very little we could talk about that he didn't seem to have a good command of. He had more background than just academia. He knew a lot of people in the industry who were movers and shakers. He knew a lot about what was being done in the industry. Henry had all the tools, and so the decision to offer him the job was pretty easy. Anybody with his skill set, another two of him would be great, yeah. The network was more than just the students and the professors and the resources of the university. With guest speakers coming in, I had an opportunity to meet and interact with high-level sustainability officers at major global corporations. In one of my classes, someone from CDP came in. I learned a lot about the organization, and I was so enthralled with what she was saying. I went up to speak with her afterwards, and she's now my boss. 10, 20 years ago, business was the enemy in the environmental movement. We've really come around and realized, well, business is part of the solution. And not only is business part of the solution to these environmental problems, but the environmental solution is part of good business. And being part of that transformation is really fulfilling. <laughs>